everything that I ever got in trouble for was it was behind the relationships I was in and behind my addiction. And when I got out, and if I didn't get some form of employment soon, I would most likely have resulted back to that. I mean, I, I had to have money, what would I have done? Pretty much all my arrests were behind um, my addiction to drugs. I got into um, very bad abusive relationships, which didn't help. I was unfunctional. I couldn't go to work like a normal person. I just never, I never grew up. When I got out, I was so desperate because I knew if I didn't find a job that I would go back to the stuff I had done before, the things that I did to support myself. Um, being a female and I just I didn't want to resort back to that lifestyle because it's just um, it's really um, horrible. <laughs> I didn't have a car. I didn't always have money for the bus and I really needed a job. Anywhere I could walk I went and applied. So there was a Denny's, there were a few gas stations, I think there was a Lucky's Market, there were some movie theaters, there was a Target. I've applied at those places and I've never heard back, so I presume that it's due to my background. Uh, I've been sober a little longer than 10 years. I live my life today with integrity. I'm honest, and I'm 50. I can't expect my family to continue supporting me. I pretty much can do anything I put my mind to, but once I get my foot in that door, um, they keep me forever and they love me. I, they know I'm a reliable employee. If it would give me the chance and the opportunity, I probably could be self-sufficient and support myself. Thank you.